guys so we are done with cleaning the house to be honest i'm quite exhausted but i'm happy with the progress because now the house is clean and i feel like i can comfortably move in i've cleaned the windows the curtain rods literally everything but the toilet i will need to do like a deep cleaning because it has some stains and yeah i just couldn't do that right now because i'm tired so anyway i quickly wanted to do an empty house to have the one that i had promised you guys he literally came to ask me what i was doing the audacity <laughs> anyway um so when you get in you find a black door and then there's a huge black window i have so many plans for that space i'm thinking uh of putting up some sheer curtains instead of like the, the normal curtains that i usually have um yeah i saw that in yvonne's candy channel and they came out looking so good and i want to maintain this lighting in this house because i've been always complaining about the quality of my videos so hopefully with that it will improve and i love how that space is looking like now i'm only imagining if you like put some clear curtains it will look so so beautiful and then we have this huge wall that i'm thinking like you can maybe put like a huge mirror and then maybe um entryway console table hear me out hear me out <laughs> that would turn out so so good yeah so like i'm saying i have so many plans for this space so hopefully everything will turn out okay um all right so after you get in you come in here and you find a toilet i remember the first time i came to look at these houses the toilet is the first thing that caught my eye the black and white contrast looks so so good and i just fell in love with it and then we have a shower head there and then we have like a road where you can place your bathroom curtain although this toilet is quite small i don't think that will be necessary but we are loving it and then that's the bucket I was using to clean the the house. And like I've said, this toilet I just cleaned it. Juju too. <laughs> I'll have to deep some I'll have to do some deep cleaning. But that will have to be another video because the way I'm tired. Another place that I love is this space here. You can place like your your bathroom essentials anything you need and yeah that's the bathroom it's um, a normal size i wouldn't say it's too big or my it's too small like it's just an average size and i love it so that's the toilet and then when you get in you will find like a kitchen section guys i don't know if i mentioned this but this is a bed sitter i think i've already mentioned it and this is the kitchen space that i absolutely love now i'm hoping that my seat will be like small enough so that it can leave some space for the bar stools by the way quick story yesterday when i came to check these houses like i was supposed to move in yesterday there was a lady who was here and i helped her move and her chair was like up to that space where you can place some bar stools so i'm hoping mine will be smaller so that it can leave some space because i want to get some bar stools by the way that lady is a subscriber of mine so shout out to you babe if you're watching it wasn't like after i finished helping her move it was like okay sour now uh what's your name and then she told me and then i was like okay nice to meet you i'm stacy she's like yeah i know i watch you i'm like what that was like such uh, an interesting interaction so anyway shout out to you if you're watching um yeah so that's the kitchen space <laughs> that's the counter countertop that i love i absolutely love i have so many ideas for this space i do and then when you get here we have this two cabinets i've already cleaned everything and that's how it looks like one thing i love about this house is the cabinets there are so many like there's so much space storage space which is always a good thing and then there's those two tumbaos there that you can use to decorate however you want and then down here there is more storage like i mentioned so yeah mm. this looks so nice you can like use it as a pantry so yeah that's how it looks like but, uh, sorry 
the only thing that I'm disappointed with is this sink. Guys, if you have um, an idea of how to remove these things, because I have tried to scrub the hell out of this sink and it's not coming out, please comment down below and give me some tips, because uh, uh, we cannot work with this. It's got to go. And I even asked the caretaker and he was like, there's nothing we can do about it. We try to remove it, but I do have a feeling that this can come out. So guys, if you have an idea of how to remove these things, kindly comment down below and I would really appreciate it. So that's the kitchen space. There's these two sockets that I'm thinking if I put my bus tools here, I can also work from here, right? Like I can uh, connect my laptop here and I can work. This is such a beautiful space, honestly. And then these tiles, it's the tiles for me. I love it. And then I love how this tap is so different from my previous <laughs> tap. My previous tap was so basic. And then the water here is plenty. And as you can see, I'm talking a lot of pressure, which is always a good thing. So that's the kitchen space. I'm thinking of buying the table, a kitchen table, because I don't have a cooker. I only have the two burner. And I don't know, I don't, I'm not planning to place it anywhere on the counter, so we'll get that. And then that's the kitchen space, and then this is now the other whole space. Let's get into the tiles. I love how they are shining. They look so beautiful. Like it looks so, so clean. It gives it such a clean look. And the white walls, but then did I mention that the walls are... The paint is oil based, so if it gets dirty, you can clean it, which is a good thing. And then there is another huge window there. So the two windows at the entrance and this window, I'm planning to put like sheer curtains, only sheer curtains, and hopefully they'll look good. And then we have a mirror there. Now, I don't know what to do with this mirror because I have the other black mirror in my house. So I'm kind of conflicted on what to do with that. I don't know, maybe I'll remove it there, I'm not sure. And then we have a closet. I've actually got some of, some of my things when I was getting the things to clean, I brought some of the things here. Because like I mentioned, like I literally live just here. So moving will be very, very quick. Uh, let's get into this closet though. Absolutely love the sliding doors. This guys, this will literally be my first time. Will it be my first? Yes. Every other house that I've lived in, I've never had a closet. Oh well, no, actually this this one house I was living at and there was a closet. Oh yeah, but now the previous one I didn't have a closet. So I'm quite excited about this one and yeah, I'm excited to see how I'll arrange it. And I love the storage to be honest. Oh, I think that door doesn't open fully. But the storage is massive. So yeah, that's the overview of the house, the tokens over there. I'm planning, I'm planning to place my TV here. I don't know if I'll mount it on the wall. Yeah, I might do that. I might buy a TV stand. Ah, I don't know. I don't know. We'll know. We'll figure everything out once we move in. But yeah, guys, that's everything. Those are the curtain rods that, that I've just cleaned. And yeah, that's it. So I hope you enjoyed the empty house tour. And stay tuned for the movie. And yeah, thank you for watching, guys. Bye.